Today I'm going to show you how to start a 2 inch wide cobra weave bracelet. At the moment I do not have a buckle that's wide enough to accept three cords which we will be using. So I'm going to use this ring. You would start it this, basically the same way on a buckle. A buckle will have a slot in it and you just insert the cord just like you would here. I'm going to use two colors so that you can see the weave, how the weave goes, and let's begin. I will take the single color, insert the loop down through the ring, pull the cord down through the loop, I will do each additional cord the same way, except I'm going to put a Kelly green cord on each side of the pink. Loop down through the front. Pull it down through the loop. That is pretty much how it would look if it was on a buckle. Now what we're going to do, we're going to start on the right side, take the outer cord. For those of you who already know how to do a cobra weave, that's all we're doing here. Take the pink cord closest to this cord and start your cobra weave. You go one, two. Every now and then, tighten up your cord so you'll have a good tight belt or bracelet, whichever you decide to use it for. These will make good two inch wide belts. We move over to the left, take the outer cord, the same as we did on the other side, take this pink cord, start your cobra weave, you go one, Two. Now you'll notice that both of your pink cords are back in the center. Take the left cord, cross it over the right cord, like so. Now we take this cord and we start the process all over. You go one, two, and we take the cord on this side, we go one, Oops, got to back up, two, we cross the left cord over the right cord again, 
Then we start all over again on the right. You go one. Two. Move back over to the left. Go one, two. Cross your left cord over your right cord. We start back on the right side. One. Two. Move back over to the left side. One. Two. Again, cross your left cord over your right. One. Two. Go back to your left. One, two, and you can see the belt taking shape. You just keep doing that until you get to the other end, ever how long you want your belt to be. Generally speaking, when you do a cobra weave, I mean, you would consider this like two different bracelets, except they're weaved together. But generally, you figure one foot of cord makes one inch of bracelet. So that's how you come up with the length of the cord you need. But this is how you do it. If you notice, you have a, a cross pattern on this side. If you turn it over, it looks like just two regular cobra weave bracelets. I hope you enjoyed. I hope it helps.